Preventing primates from escaping at the Kansas City Zoo. The orangutan canopy is weeks from being completed, and that means making sure all the animals can't get out. Now, you may recall, as we do, it was this time last year, the seven chimpanzees made an escape by breaking down a tree limb, putting the zoo in a code red situation. The zoo doesn't want it to happen again. Game is tonight's Brian Johnson tonight on what they're doing to make sure it doesn't. After months of construction, the new orangutan canopy is being put to the test, and the workers are watching. Nine climbers from the Kansas City Climbing Club say they felt honored to take the place of wild animals. If we can climb out, the orangutan will be able to climb out, and that wouldn't be safe for you know the zoo um, or any visitors. That fear became reality just last year when one chimpanzee broke a tree limb and encouraged six others to join in the escape. So these climbers gave it their all to get out. Each step is significant progress. But no matter how strong, skillful, or how impressive, each climber ended the same on the ground. The climbers are testing the sides of the exhibit, but what about the back? We'll show you. There is a 14-foot drop-off. This moat will keep the orangutans from escaping out the back. We certainly don't want to open this providing a pathway out, so we want to try to identify those now. Uh, what happens in the future and you know, that another failure. <laughs> <laughs> you can hear that. <laughs> In the end, each climber left defeated, which means success. Game is tonight's Brian Johnson reporting. The director says this new exhibit costs six million to build. It'll be the first time in more than a decade the orangutans get to feel the sunshine and the grass.